Time now is 11 o'clock. Meteorologist Zane Satry joining you again. Another uh, severe weather update. No active severe weather. Still ongoing. Still a little bit early, but we talked about a half hour ago. If you were watching KCCI about tornado watch that was issued now in effect for all of your yellow colored counties, the southern about third to half of the state. But all the storms moving through Iowa right now are all non severe, but there's quite a bit of lightning, thunder and heavy rain here. I'm actually going to turn the thunder or turn the lightning off here on the radar just so you can see a little bit better. All right, plenty of some uh, rainfall moving through stretching from let's say Fort Dodge down towards Boone along Highway 141 now into the Des Moines metro area. Another storm moving into the city here and then a mean looking cell that's moving up towards let's play say about southwestern Marion County, Melcher, Dallas, just to the south and west of Knoxville. That cell a short time ago did produce some uh, three quarter inch size hail, so it's a little smaller than a quarter size down when it was towards Sheraton about uh, 10 or 15 miles off to the south and west. None of these other storms though are severe. You just see a lot of messiness, a lot of rain, a lot of lightning and thunder that stretches up through the middle of the state right now. That's kind of the status of things. Actually, all these storms that are, let's say north of I-80, they're into some cooler air at the surface, so they probably can't produce any kind of a tornadic activity at all. But you notice there's a little bit less coverage down in southern Iowa. That's why we're watching that zone for the potential or for some severe, more severe thunderstorms as we go through later on today. Northern Iowa, you see just some more storms too. In the Des Moines Metro, folks, if you're starting to see some feel here. We just heard a rumble of thunder over at the station. Western suburbs, Des Moines, uh, downtown Des Moines, southeastward, also starting to pick up on some heavy rain. Live look from our West Des Moines camera shows that rainfall coming down. There probably are going to be some stronger wind gusts, maybe 40, maybe 50 miles per hour tops. That wouldn't technically qualify as severe, though. Uh, we're going to be keeping an eye on these storms, though, as we go through the rest of the day. So the big takeaway still for the time being this morning, until 6 p.m., tornado watch in effect roughly I-80 southward, Highway 92 southward, until 6 p.m. this evening. We'll have a full update on the current weather situation here coming up in an hour on KCCI 8 News at Noon.